Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel, Yasa's Universe. It's me, Yasa. This is going to be an all signs reading, your person's current feelings. So if you're single, this may or may not resonate. But even if you do have somebody, it still may or may not resonate because y'all know this is general. Y'all know how tarot is, time is fluid, and all of that extra shit, okay? How y'all been? Everybody, please check out your April monthlies. I've already uploaded them. Y'all get my shit up to over 100 views, over 100 likes. All right, Dang. so <laughs> y'all, um, you can like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, leave me a love donation. You can book a personal reading with me. I'm not working currently, so you guys booking readings with me really does help me. You guys donating really does help me. I'm also trying to make some things happen, y'all. I got plans. I got big plans, but let's jump into it. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, protect me as I go within the tarot. Keep me safe. Close our doors, send on negative sneaks in, and only the ones I promise time are welcome here. Ancestors, please look straight this reading. No weapon that's formed against me shall prosper. Keep me safe. Keep my viewers safe. Protect the messages. Ashe. All right. Thank you, universe. Let's jump into it. Y'all know how it is. All the way from Aries to Pisces. I'm sorry for any noise, y'all. Y'all know I stay right by uh, the tollway. All right. All right, let me get comfortable. We good? Okay, we're good. Okay, y'all. Let's go. Your person's current feelings, Aries. All right. Remember, flip off the roads, reverse them. Um, this could have already happened because we have things now could happen in the near future, y'all. And I'm gonna try to keep these short because I got a babysit in a second. Okay. All right, Aries. Three of Pentacles. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Their current feelings is they want to work with you on this. Okay, I feel like it may be a long shot, but with perfect planning, strategizing, and things like that, they feel like they can make it work with you. Or they're wanting you to make it work with them. Nine of Swords, this person is worried, stressed, depressed. Aries is being... Have y'all seen um, Bridezilla? That's how y'all been. Ain't it y'all birthday? It's, it's Aries season. Y'all is just doing the fool. Got people just stressing out you want your birthday to be perfect and all of that extra stuff i understand your person's current feelings what is aries person's current feelings the eight of pentacles wanting to put in more work so i feel like this person is like what will it take for aries to see how much work that i'm trying to put into this we got um the hierophant taurus or libra and the empress i feel like this person wants to make like a grand gesture this person is prob probably saving a lot of money to try to impress you give you a gift take you somewhere because we got the three to three of pentacles wanting to work together on you the three of pentacles isn't a lot of money but with the nine of swords it's like thinking planning like what can i do how do i make my money grow eight of pentacles how can i work this out with aries because they see you as the empress, beautiful energy. So this could be your baby mom, your baby dad, or this could be someone you live with. Or you are already married to this person, or they may be married to someone else. But what's this person's current feelings towards Aries? The Queen of Cups. They love you. They love you. The Ace of Cups. They love you. They want to give you a gift. This person could be wanting to get plant that seed, okay? I see children. <laughs> they love you. What's the nine of swords for? Why are they stressed? They're overthinking. You are all they can think about. The hermit. You could be dealing with the Virgo. Yeah, they're an overthinker, an overanalyzer. Page of Wands moves to the King of Wands. All right? A lot of growth with this person. So this person is thinking of... The long term, the first initial message, the first dating phase, moving to the king of wands. This takes time, effort, energy, all of that. So this person is thinking of spending a lot of time with you. The page of wands don't just turn to the king of wands overnight. They know this is going to take a, some time, energy, and effort. That's how they feel. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, it's all about money and stability as well with this person. Queen of Pentacles, the Eight of Wands, the Sun, and the Four of Wands. They want to live with you. They want to move in with you. They want to be stable. They want to 
make sure that they're financially ready. They don't want to depend on you. They want you to be able to depend on them, but they see you as the Empress. Like, what will really impress the Empress? And that's what they're thinking about with the Nine of Swords. Kings and Queens came out. King of um, Wands. The Queen of uh, Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, Kings, Queens have came out. The Empress, like the only wand that came out, like the only page was the Page of Wands, but he turned into the King of Wands. I like this person. They're ready to put in the effort, time, energy, attention. Damn. All right, Taurus. It's almost Taurus season. Come through, Taurus. What's this person's current feelings towards Taurus? Ooh, the King of Cups. Come through, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. They have love for you, especially with the star card. It could be an Aquarius. This person is has emotion for you. They feel things. They feel for you. All right, we got the, nine, the Knight of Swords as well. Clarify the Knight of Swords. This person is either saying something or doing something. Nine of Swords. They're stressing. We have the Death card. It could be a Scorpio. Something did end or they want something to change, transform. Their feelings for you have changed. It went from, it may have went to just friendship and turned into love with the Two of Cups. I feel like this person's feelings grow deeper and deeper for you as every day goes by. Clarify the King of Cups. Clarify the King of Cups for Taurus. Two of Pentacles. They're wondering if you feel the same way. Three of Swords. This could have been a third party situation. I feel like there was an ending between you two. If not, Taurus, the person who has feelings for you is somebody who just got out of a relationship. That's how you'll know who they are. Clarify the Two of Pentacles and the King of Cups for this person's feelings for Taurus. Five of Pentacles, yeah. They don't think you feel the same way. They can feel that you're holding back from them. Clarify the star. The Knight of Wands. They want to come through with the passionate communication. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Like, they're wondering, like, okay, if Taurus won't love me again because of how I'm trying to give them love, maybe they'll love me again if I break them off real good. Or maybe they'll love me again if I change with the death card. Maybe they'll love me again if I give them a gift. All right, we got the Ten of Cups. So this could be someone you live with, someone you have children with, someone you've been with, with the, for a long time, or maybe just someone you've seen long-term with. Clarify the Knight of Swords and the Nine of Swords. Two of Swords. You can be dealing with an Earth sign. This person is stuck in their head. The Three of Swords at the bottom of the deck again. This has ended. You two are not together. But this person is longing for you. This person is in regret with the Nine of Swords, Knight of Swords, Two of Swords, Three of Swords. Deep regret. But I feel like this person, this person is praying for um, another pathway to you like how will i ever have another chance with taurus clarify the death card you could be dealing with a scorpio or an aquarius but clarify the death card for this person's feelings for taurus the eight of cups you you're distant you broke up with them no communication at all with the hermit card ghosted you either ghosted them or they ghosted you clarify the two of cups The Knight of Cups. Yeah, this person is still in love with you. The Devil card. They're obsessed over you. Very obsessive and possessive. It could be a Capricorn. Clarify the Knight of Cups and the Two of Cups for this person's feelings for Taurus. Six of Cups. They want to reconcile, Taurus. Like, every single card of reconciliation has came out. Two of Cups, Knight of Cups, Six of Cups, Ten of Cups. They want to reconcile. So this person's current feelings is this is someone who either ghosted you, put you through a third party situation or or just was on some fuck shit. They could have just distanced themselves from you. They do love you. It could be a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio, Scorpio strong or it's an Aquarius. Share their wish fulfillment. This person's current feelings is the one 
it's the one that did you wrong i'm not gonna lie they're missing you they're in regret they're wanting you bad all right moving on to gemini Gemini. What's this person's current feelings towards Gemini? What's this person's current feelings towards Gemini? The King of Swords. They could be an air sign like yourself, a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. They want a new start with you whether this is an old person or a new person. I'm going to read it as a new person because we have an ace here. This is a new person who sees you as a king of swords. You're not so, you're not immature. You're not some a child. You're a good communicator. They want to know more about you. They feel like you're very knowledgeable and it's easy for you to make decisions. They see you as being yourself in your element. Okay? They want a new they they want to be with you. They want to experience you. This is someone who want, who hasn't experienced you before. But the ace of wands they want to experience communication with you they want to experience travel and passion with you they want to experience sex with you as well ace of wands could be a pregnancy card as well this could be a cancer with the chariot they want to see where things will go they already know in the back of their mind i want this with gemini and they're acting on it with the chariot all right, we have the star, could be an Aquarius, and here's your match right here, the Queen of Swords. The King and Queen of Swords. It could be an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini you're connecting with, or a Cancer. I like this person. I feel like they have it all figured out. They know they have to have it all figured out if they're going to deal with you, because you're very um, forthcoming, I feel. Clarify the Ace of Wands for this person's feelings for Gemini. Queen of Cups. They are in love. They are in love. Eight of Cups. They're wondering why you're so distant and how they can close the distance, close the gap. They're wondering, okay, Gemini is a pretty smart person. Gemini is pretty witty. So maybe I'll use my sexuality, my femininity, or maybe I'll use my my masculine prowess for on Gemini. What do they like? What, what intrigues Gemini? Clarify the Queen of Cups and the Ace of Wands. The lovers exactly <laughs> exactly what what is gemini like in them sheets okay <laughs> i like them <laughs> this could be you and how you feel about someone clarify the chariot for this person's current feelings for gemini the three of pentacles yeah i want to work with gemini i i just all i hear is i want to see what gemini is about they're excited to see I feel like this is a new person. You're a new person for them as well. Like this is a new experience. Clarify the Three of Pentacles and the Chariot for this person's current feelings towards Gemini. The Five of Wands. Maybe this person could be being met with resistance. Maybe you're being met with resistance because of other people, what other people might be saying. We do have the Three of Pentacles here. I feel like this person could be getting advice about you. Because I see two queens, the queen of swords, the queen of cups, and then the queen of pentacles. Maybe this person is like, does Gemini like this? Does he like, does he like a smart woman? Does Gemini like, does Gemini like this? Does he like a feminine woman, an emotional woman? Does Gemini like this? A, a stable woman who has all, all these things together, like they're trying to see you. Vice versa for the men. Does Gemini like this type of man, that type of man? You know, clarify the star for this person's current feelings towards Gemini. Death. Could be done with the Scorpio. Ooh, I like this. We have the King of Cups right here. So we have two matches, the King and Queen of Swords and then the King and Queen of Cups. This, I feel like this could be a soulmate twin flame that you have coming out. We have the Emperor and the High Priestess. The divine masculine right here clarified death in the star so this is a complete new love cycle a complete new person journey that you're going on with this person clarify the star and the death card for this person's current feelings towards gemini Woo, shit. Mm. 
before Juan's done flew all the way over to the other side of the room. So yes, you two will be in a relationship. I like this for you, Gemini. High Priestess could be a Pisces. Do you see the death? It's, it's a change, a transformation. So I feel like this person has changed. You have changed. You two are completely different people. And you're your most authentic versions of yourself entering into this new soul contract. I like this person. You have two matches coming out. The King and Queen of Swords, the King and Queen of Cups. This is your soulmate. This is a per your person's current feelings is. This is my soulmate. Gemini is my soulmate. Cancer. What's this person's current feelings towards cancer? Cancer. All right, here you are coming out with the moon and the seven of pentacles. I feel like this person, um, this person is anxious. You see the seven of pentacles, how somebody's just laying down, the other person is racing the damn skeleton. This person is anxious about something, a reconciliation. The death card keeps coming out for a lot of people. Let me see. Okay. Clarify the moon for cancer. Clarify the moon for this person's current feelings towards cancer. They feel like you're mysterious. Maybe they want to find the truth out about you. Maybe you're not telling the truth about something. Or you could just be dealing with another cancer. Ace of Pentacles. The world. This is a new person as well. So we have Cancer Pisces and then we have Scorpio. The Ace of Pentacles. This person wants... I see somebody giving you a gift. I also see pregnancy as well. You could be getting pregnant or you could already be pregnant or having a baby shower. Clarify the Seven of Pentacles for this person's current feelings towards cancer. The Seven of Pentacles usually is a being patient, you know, uh, planting seeds, taking time and things like that, investing. But I'm getting just from... The picture of this card. I'm getting this person is like trying to cheat death. That's honestly what I'm getting. They're trying to cheat death. He's racing against the skeleton. Clarify the Seven of Pentacles. Justice. Are they trying to run away from what's right and what's fair? They're trying to run away from the seeds that they've planted. You either planted good seeds or you planted not so good seeds. Clarify justice in the seven of pentacles for this person's current feelings towards cancer. The three of swords. Exactly. That's what I'm getting. Knight of pentacles. I get that this person is trying to slow down time. Or trying to slow you down. Because you have the Ace of Pentacles and the world on your end right under the moon. So you're good. You are having a new beginning, a new phase of life, new gifts and all of that. While this person may be having to face karma with the Justice card. You can't slow time down though. It's going to happen eventually. Clarify the Six of Cups. The Eight of Swords. Yeah, I feel like this person doesn't want to... This person... You told this person that they would be back. If not, they always knew that they would be back. And maybe they were like, I thought I had enough time before I had to go back to cancer or some shit like that. Clarify the Six of Cups and the Eight of Swords for this person's current feelings towards cancer. King of Swords. Yeah, you said you said this to them. You'll be back. You knew they'd be back. Six of Cups. This could be uh, your baby mom or baby dad. Like, I knew you'd be back. But it's kind of like a what the fuck do you want type energy. Also, for those of you who are single, I feel like you feel like you're bound to your family. You're bound to your brothers and sisters and your mom. You feel like you're bound to them. And, like, you just have been trying to manifest a way to, like, never have to fuck with them again or fuck with them from a distance. 
clarify death for this person's current feelings towards cancer. Some of y'all could have Leo in your chart. The Ace of Wands with the death card. Page of Swords. King of Wands. A lot of fire energy. Okay, clarify death and the Ace of Wands for this person's current feelings towards cancer. The Nine of Wands, it's like, yeah, um, I knew you'd be back, so run me my money or something like that. Do they owe you money? Run me my money. Seven of because they have the seven of pentacles, justice, and the knight of the knight of pentacles. Run me my money. So somebody either owes you a loan or owes you child support, or they owe you. Also, I'm saying if somebody tried to hold you or scam you, like they tried to give you the short end of the stick, it actually backfired on them. So you got all the money and they didn't. I'm seeing this person's current feelings is they're trying to buy it as much time. They're trying to play a waiting game with you, Cancer. That's all I'm getting from the cards. They're trying to play a waiting game with you. I don't see you actually giving a fuck. You have the Ace of Pentacles here and the world card you're having fun you're probably traveling you're getting money as well blessings making purchases i don't i don't see you giving a fuck about them you can be dealing with a scorpio aquarius leo taurus libra but yeah justice is on your side i see justice so um karma is is at play Whatever they did, whatever you did, whatever they didn't do, whatever you didn't do, whatever. But I don't see you um, hurting at all, Cancer. All right, Leo. Leo. Page of Swords. What's this person's current feelings towards Leo? What's this person's current feelings toward Leo? What's this person's current feelings towards Leo? Alright. What's this person's current feelings towards Leo? Page of Swords. They watching you, stalking you, spying on you. They see you doing good too. Nine of Pentacles. Look at you. All this money, these coins... Is this cantaloupe? It looked like cantaloupe. I just had me some cantaloupe the other day. It was so good. But look at this. Like, this is your harvest. You're reaping the rewards. Everything that you sow, you're receiving so much from it. Beautiful energy. We got the hair fit right here. What's this person's current feelings towards Leo? seven of wands all right so let's see clarify the page of swords this could be a gemini libra or an aquarius clarify the page of swords for this person's current feelings towards leo they're watching you studying you spying on you getting information on you or um wanting to speak to you ace of pentacles wanting a new beginning this could be a new earth sign or new air sign eight of swords i'm getting this person could be stuck on you and it is someone from the past six of cups here we go. Queen of Wands. Damn, you fine, Leo. Fine ass motherfucker. You fine, Leo. Clarify the page of swords and the ace of pentacles for this person's current feelings towards Leo. Five of Pentacles. So they feel left out. They they feel left out. Five of Pentacles. How they feel about you? They feel that they're low-key wondering why you're not doing so bad without them with the five of pentacles this is a you're supposed to be doing bad you're supposed to be feeling sad and left out in the cold and shit like that but you have the ace of pentacles right here you're not doing bad you're actually really good great even the fuck did they think so this person is checking on you to see if you're doing bad without them and they're going to be bad because you're not you're not doing bad without them. Even if you did lose a job with the Five of Pentacles or maybe you had to make a big purchase, this money is coming right back to you, Ace of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles as well. You're great. You're single. You're doing good. 
you're doing good. Every single thing that you open, every every fruit, every gift, every every door, you it's beautiful, Leo. The fuck did they think? I don't know. Clarify the nine of pentacles for this person's current feelings for Leo. You're good by yourself. You're good single, living a single life. Clarify the nine of pentacles for this person's current feelings. Strength, exactly. You and your element. Leo is Leo. Leo will always be Leo. That's how they feel about you. But I feel like, damn, I still, I still fuck with Leo. I'm still stuck on Leo. Still, I cannot stop thinking about Leo. Leo is so strong. That's what I'm getting, like this energy. Like this person is like, Leo's so strong. <sighs> Clarify the nine of pentacles and the strength for this person's current feelings for Leo. Four of Wands, they want to be with you. They seeing you doing all good and stable. Six of Wands, they want a victory with you. Three of Cups, they reminiscing about you, wanting to celebrate with you, wanting to reconcile with you. Six of Swords, wanting to move towards you, close the distance, close the gap. Nine of Cups, you they wish fulfillment, Leo. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Leo said, I knew it all along. Let me uh, brush my shoulders off. I got 99 problems, but this bitch ain't one. I feel like, like, Leo is cocky than a motherfucker, and I love it. I love that shit. Leo always get a bad rep for being cocky, but if you ain't being cocky, they trying to fuck you over, Leo. So just do the shit anyway. Because I'm seeing, why the fuck would you ever just try to pop back in to see if I'm doing bad? No, I'm not doing bad. I'm actually doing great. Nine of Pentacles. I'm in my element strength. I'm still strong. I'm still that guy. I'm still that bitch. What? Four of Wands. I got a new house. You probably in a new relationship. If not, this motherfucker want to come in and be in a relationship with you, have victory and success with you. But what I'm seeing is, Leo, this whole road right here, this could all be new energy. Like all of this good, positive energy that you in, you could already be with somebody else. Already close that chapter in your life and open in a new chapter. Like, man, th th you probably threw that whole book away and you writing a whole nother book, like a whole different narrative to your life. Clarify the Hierophant for this person's current feelings for Leo. The Ace of Swords. They want to come in and talk. Leo, I love you. I still have feelings for you. I want to take a leap of faith with you. Let's travel, Leo. I want to plant some good seeds with you, Leo. I want to plant some good seeds with you, Leo. I'm sorry for breaking your heart, Three of Swords. Man man this is the ace of swords ace of cups and you have the ace of pentacles you probably telling this person fuck out of here okay get the fuck out of here i have a brand new life all right we is good clarify the seven of wands for this person's current feelings towards leo you not letting them in, Leo. They're the devil. Look, do not let the devil in, Leo. What the fuck? You not letting them in. Don't do it. Stay ghost on them, Leo. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. You are the empress. Uh-uh. What the fuck? Clarify the devil in the seven of wands for this person's current feelings towards Leo. They like that shit. They like you not letting them in. That makes them even more obs obsessive. And possessive, clarify the devil and the seven of wands for this person's current feelings. Three of pentacles, they still gonna try. They still gonna try. Magician, they gonna try to manifest some type of way to get some messages. Travel with you, they gonna try to manifest some type of way to get y'all to alone and shit. And talk to you. You gonna, They gonna force you to talk to them and shit. Death card could be a Scorpio. They gonna try to make some changes. They talking about they done change. We got the emperor right here. And the empress. What is this? And the lovers too? It's a Gemini. If it's a Gemini, fuck with them. I say, yeah, fuck with them if it's a Gemini. Ooh, wait. We got the lovers, the king of pentacles, the king of cups. You probably got a, and the king of wands. We got, tell me we got three kings. Tell me we got three kings. King of wands, king of cups, king of pentacles. Who's this new person? I like them with the lovers. You got a couple people after you, Leo. A couple of them. You look good, Leo. She and I'm not mad at you. This person's current feelings is Leo. So 
and they have two minds about it. One of their minds is like, I want a new beginning with Leo. Their other mind is, Leo probably already got somebody else. Leo is sexy, beautiful. There's no way that Leo isn't being chased by other people. And they motherfucking right. Okay? Let's see if they're going to come with it. I don't see any bad cards, Leo. Not gonna, I'm not going to lie. I'm not even going to hold this person. But I'm just trying to see if they want you now that they see you doing good. What's the devil card before I close this? What's the devil card? Ten of Wands. It's going to be as hard as, as hard as it was back then. It'll probably be even harder now if you deal with this person. Moving on. Virgo. What's this person's current feelings towards Virgo? What's this person's current feelings towards Virgo? Alright. What's this person's current feelings towards Virgo? Page of Wands. They want to talk with you, communicate with you as well. They feel like you have secrets and you're hiding something. Uh, but you're beautiful and sexy as fuck. And they want, they want, um, they want to heal this. That's what they want. But they feel like you don't want them back. It is someone from the past with the Six of Cups, someone who broke your heart, or someone you broke their heart with the Three of Swords. Could have been a third party situation and you chose someone else or you chose your job over them. Clarify the Page of Wands for this person's current feelings. Four of Wands, they do want to be in a relationship with you. It's a fire sign, Aries Leo Sag. Clarify the moon for this person's current feelings towards Sagittarius. Seven of Pentacles. Clarify the moon and the Seven of Pentacles. They feel like you've been putting your time somewhere else. Ten of Cups. Okay, I'm not going to lie. They feel like you have another family. Or you have someone else. They feel like they're your mistress or your mister. Clarify the Ten of Cups and the Seven of Pentacles. Because the Seven of Pentacles is putting your time, energy, and effort into something and then the moon card is hiding that so where have you been where have you been putting your time energy and effort virgo all right clarify the ten of cups for this person's current feelings towards virgo page of pentacles they feel like you have a secret family seven of swords you ten of swords yeah you like what the Damn, what the fuck is in my eyebrows? Clarify the Seven of Swords and the Ten of Swords. So I'm feeling like this part. Oh, fuck. This person. What is in my eye? Sorry, y'all. This person thinks that you. How do I explain this? This person has. Is getting. Downloads, messages, um, information about a secret that you have. Especially if you have a secret family or if you're fucking with somebody else or dealing with somebody else besides them. This person feels like you're going to try to hide. You're going to try to hide it. I feel like this person already knows, though. Clarify the Queen of Wands for this person's current feelings for Virgo. The hermit. Yeah, you got somebody else. You're hiding somebody else under wraps. Clarify the hermit and the queen of wands. Three of cups. You're going to try to reconcile. So I'm getting, I'm just getting a storyline and this may not be for y'all. Y'all might fall off. I'm getting there's somebody that you are with. They know that you're going to go back to that person you said you were done with. They know that you're going to go back to whoever that secret affair was. That's weird. We have the Ten of Swords. So if you did, I'm getting a storyline of there was a Virgo who had a wife or who had a family. He stepped outside of his wife and stepped outside of his family. Probably fell in love with the person he stepped out with, but he didn't stay with the person he stepped out with. He went back to his wife and his family. The wife and the family broke up and got divorced, and he's going back to the person he stepped out with in the, in the first place. 
yeah <laughs> all right so okay right what's this person's current feelings for virgo do you have another storyline you can tell me do you have another storyline you can tell me what's this person's current feelings towards virgo ten of wands it's hard with you and you are very stubborn you could be dealing with the leo you feel like it's hard with them what's this person's current feelings Queen of Cups, they are, they're still in love with you, though, no matter how hard they try to resist. Page of Pentacles, you're going to get a way through to them somehow. Somehow, clarify the Ten of Wands for this person's current feelings for you. Knight of Wands, they feel like you're a waste of time. The Devil card, and you're toxic. You feel like they're a waste of time. They're the devil, they're toxic. Or you could just be dealing with a Sagittarius or a Capricorn. But this person... I feel like this person puts their dick through a lot or they put their pussy through a lot. Especially if they fuck in the whole city or the whole town. They probably can't get up no more. Um, just being honest. Yeah. So clarify the strength for this person's current feelings for Virgo. They feel like they need to hold back from you. Ten of Pentacles. But they see it all with you. This could be somebody you're already married to or somebody who did see long term with you. And I feel like that's why it's so hard for them to hold back. They saw a long term with you at one point in time. And then we have the fool wanting to take a leap of faith. And this queen of wands, y'all still have passion for each other. Y'all still want to bump uglies. Still. Clarify the queen of cups for this person's current feelings for Virgo. They still love you. Seven of pentacles. They feel like waiting on you is a waste of time. Knight of pentacles. It ain't going to go nowhere. Clarify the Queen of Cups and the Seven of Pentacles for this person's current feelings for Virgo. Five of Wands. They, oof, they feel like people are still going to get involved. It's going to be dramatic. It's going to be messy. And they feel like as soon as they get their feelings involved, that's when it all starts turning to shit. They feel like if they don't get feelings for you, it'll be fine. But if they have feelings for you, for some reason, it turns to shit. Clarify the Page of Pentacles for this person's current feelings towards Virgo. Queen of Swords, yeah, they feel like they got to just be, like, super abrasive, logical. They can't let their emotions get in the way. We have three queens, Queen of Wands, Queen of Cups, and the Three of Swords. They feel like you a player. Clarify the Page of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords for this person's current feelings. Five of Cups, they feel like it's going to end in disaster. And they just going to have to walk away from you and find love somewhere else. All right, but for some reason, y'all keep coming back to each other with the Wheel of Fortune. So they feel like it's a karmic cycle. Yeah. All right. Libra. Let me hurry up. If the messages don't make sense, I'm not doing the second one. Libra. What's this person's current feelings towards Libra? What's this person's current feelings towards Libra? Eight of Swords, they're stuck in your head, stuck in their head over you. They don't feel like they can make a decision. They don't see a way forward. But they do want to break through in communication with the Ace of Swords. And then we have the Six of Swords. This person is an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Or this is you, Libra, all your energy. Eight of Swords, Two of Swords, Ace of Swords, Six of Swords. Clarify the Eight of Swords for this person's current feelings towards Libra. The Chariot. Uh, they want to find a way out of their head. They do still love you, though, with the Two of Cups. Who is this? I don't know who that is. All right. Clarify the Two of Swords for Libra. The Hermit. They feel like. The only way to get over you over you is to just stop talking to you. They feel they are traumatized from you ghosting them as well, Libra. Clarify the two of swords and the hermit. You could be dealing with the Virgo. It'll be Libra Virgo, cuz. Um, then the Emperor. You have a hard time expressing your feelings and you're stubborn as hell. It's just no winning with you, Libra. Or that's how you feel about them, Ace of Swords. But for some reason, this person got to be crazy as fuck to be dealing with you because they still want to talk to you with the Ace of Swords. 
Eight of Wands, they still want to talk to you, have fun with you and shit. Nine of Cups, you're their wish fulfillment. So it's like this person always comes back to you because they're wondering where it went wrong and wondering if you guys can just finally make it right. Clarify the Six of Swords for this person's current feelings for you, for Libra. Page of Pentacles, they still want to give to this. Seven of Cups, but they're confused though. The Sun card, you could have children with this person or it could be a Leo, but they're going to, they want to give this one more chance. No, even though it does sound crazy as hell. <sighs> They're going to ask you, is this crazy? <laughs> Scorpio. Do you think I'm crazy? Scorpio. What's this person's current feelings towards Scorpio? The Knight of Pentacles taking their time. Oh, they feel like you're a liar, you're a cheater, a heartbreaker, deceiver with the Four of Cups. You're never coming back to my love, Nine of Swords. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles for this person's current feelings towards Scorpio. Knight of Wands. Okay, one minute they don't hear from you. The next minute y'all in the bed fucking. The next minute y'all getting food and being all lovey-dovey. Then the next minute they don't hear from you again. And it's toxic than a bitch and it's confusing than a bitch. But they can't quit the dick. They can't quit the punani. Give me a second, y'all. Hey, y'all, I'm back. Um, was that Scorpio we was on? So listen, Scorpio. <sighs> what were we saying? This person feels like it's too on and off. Death card. Here you are right here. Maybe it's you feeling that way. It's too on and off. The death card and the tower. With the four of cups, it's like, stop, start, stop, start, stop, start. Clarify the seven of swords. This person could be hiding something, um, avoiding something. The three of swords, it's a heartbreak. They're avoiding the end. I feel like they know that you want to break up with them and they're avoiding it. Clarify the nine of swords. Or you're avoiding breaking up with this person. And you know you've checked out emotionally, mentally, physically. Well, y'all probably still haven't sex. The Queen of Wands is out, so don't lie. But <laughs> you've checked out emotionally and mentally. The Magician. But you still have a spark for them. You still have a flame for them. Nine of Swords. So it's like, you're at this person, their feelings for you is... Do I really, really, really want to end it with Scorpio? I haven't been feeling fulfilled. I haven't been complete. But I still feel a spark for Scorpio with the Magician's card. I still feel a tie to them. Or maybe somebody been doing sex magic. Whatever it is, this could be how you feel. It's too on and off. I'm, I've already checked out emotionally and mentally. I do still have a flame for this person. And how they feel is they're just wondering what's going to happen next with the Seven of Cups. What's going to happen next? What should I do next? So this person, their feelings for you, they're confused right now. But I don't see them ending it. But they may have been thinking about it and you can feel it. Come on, Sag. <sighs> Sagittarius. What's this person's current feelings towards Sagittarius? The Seven of Cups came out. What is this? Oh, the Empress. They feel like you got options. They feel like you're out of their league. Four of Swords. You're out of their league. Magician. With the uh, Judgment right here. And the Nine of Pentacles. Here they are. Sagittarius popping up right here. High Priestess. Nine of Cups. The Hermit. All right. Clarify the Seven of Cups. They feel like you got options. Someone is confused or um, lying to themselves. Ace of Wands. This person is completely shook over the sex. The lovers. The Two of Cups. Yep. If y'all have had sex, this person has moved in. You need to um, make sure they got space in the bottom drawer. Their toothpaste is there. You're going to wake up in this motherfucker making you breakfast. And they done pulled your iron and your ironing board out. And they ironing your clothes. All right, <laughs> clarify the empress. You can be dealing with the Taurus, Libra, Virgo, Sagittarius, Pisces, Scorpio. Clarify the empress or a Gemini. We got the lovers and the two of cups. Seven of swords with the empress. Clarify the empress and the seven of swords. 
the sun. What? Is this a secret love affair? This is supposed to be a secret. Now you pregnant. Oh, you got back with your baby daddy. Oh, we figured it out. You got back with your baby mama. And you said you wouldn't, but you did. Okay. Knight of Cups. You and the kids is together. We back. We here. You and the you you and with you and the family and the kids is back together again. You found a way back in, baby. Clarify the four of swords. Page of wands. Yeah. Hey, I missed you, Daddy. You and Mama back together. What? <laughs> we got the Ace of Cups and the Queen of Cups. Yep. Me and Mama is back together and we having another baby. Okay. And this don't have to be a story. Sad. Sad. You said you was not going back to them, and here you are. Clarify the magician. The devil. They got a hold on you. They got a hold on you. The magician and uh, the devil card. Somebody been putting in that work. Clarify the devil and the magician. The world card. Yep. We back at it again. Ace of Swords. We back talking. That's, what, that's all I hear. We back talking again. That's what I hear. This person's current feelings for you, they want to talk again. They want to talk again. If this isn't an old person, I do see a new person that you will have a very strong connection with. I feel like this will be a roller coaster, a whirlwind romance. There's a lot of love, a lot of passion here. The sun, the lovers, the devil, it, they all here. All of it. So... This person, how they currently feel, y'all are going through different phases in y'all relationship, but they down. They down for it. This person ain't going nowhere that easily. They come, here they come. Capricorn. What's this person's current feelings towards Capricorn? Seven of Pentacles. You taking too long. Ten of Pentacles. They want a family now. <laughs> three of cups they they want to um get back together with you the chariot here they come <sighs> they think you work too much you probably travel for work probably drive trucks or something clarify the seven of pentacles for this person's current feelings towards capricorn the four of pentacles and the knight of wands like Y'all don't have sex often. Y'all do have sex, but it's not often. Seven of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles. It takes a like if clarify the the Four of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Death. Okay. I'm sorry, that's not death. That's the Tower. And then the um, Empress. But here's death anyway. I've I've already said it. So what I'm getting is. This person is seven months pregnant. The person, because I'm getting a storyline of there's somebody you're coming back to see who you haven't seen in a long time. When you come back, it's going to be something different about them. Or when you come back, they're going to be pregnant. When you come back, they probably won't even be in the same city, same town, same state. All right, clarify the Ten of Pentacles for this person's current feelings for Capricorn. Five of Wands. We got the Nine of Cups, which will film it. Clarify the Five of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles. The Knight of Swords. So I feel like this person, there's something you, excuse me, there's something you did or something you said that got this person um, a little combative against you. I feel like you chose work over them, the Ten of Pentacles. Um, this person don't like that you make them not feel good enough with the five of wands and the knight of swords they don't think you're a good communicator either clarify the three of cups clarify the three of cups for this person's feelings justice they feel like it would be right and fair for you to make it up to them or make up with them with the three of cups and reconcile with them what their feelings is, you need to do it. They're not going to do it. But the hair friend, they're not. Don't expect them to. Taurus, Libra, Cancer, Sagittarius, Scorpio energy. Clarify the chariot for uh, this person's current feelings towards Capricorn. The lovers. 
<laughs> and the Queen of Wands and the Eight of Pentacles. If you come back for this person, they'll be uh part of them is waiting on you with the lovers they still love you they still have passion for you the queen of wands they still think you're beautiful they still like your communication they like your connection i don't see a, like a super heavy energy on y'all but i just feel like this person feels like they don't have all of you they don't have your complete attention And it could just be because of your work, your job. All right. Aquarius. What's this person's current feelings towards Aquarius? Whoa. this person's current feelings towards Aquarius the ace of pentacles Ooh, it's a new person six of pentacles how do I uh spend more time with Aquarius eight of swords they're stuck on you what is this what's this person's current feelings towards Aquarius exactly the sun it's a Leo they're stuck on you they want children with you they want to move in with you they're about to send you a message with the page of wands. They're, they want to flirt with you. How can I spend more time with Aquarius? How can I get Aquarius to spend more time with me? Give me more attention. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles. The Nine of Wands. Why you got your guards up, Aquarius? Don't you know I love you? I want to be with you for a wands. Now open the door, Aquarius. This person crazy. <laughs> this person is popping up at your house. Open the door, Aquarius. Oh, open the door. Clarify the Six of Pentacles. Clarify the Six of Pentacles for this person's current feelings towards Aquarius. The Tower. This person... This person could be a Scorpio, but this person... I don't know. I, I see you trying to avoid this Tower moment. That's why you're not opening the door, Aquarius. I'm not opening the door. I'm not doing it. They're going to fuck up my shit. They're going to fuck up all the progress that I made. Clarify the Tower and the Six of Pentacles for this person's current feelings towards Aquarius. The Eight of Wands. But I just want to have some fun. Let's travel. Let's go out to eat. I done came all the way down here to see you, Aquarius. Queen of Cups. I love you. Aquarius, don't you know it's all love, baby? Ooh, now, put, now I, want, I want to get some of that punani. Or I want to get some of that dick with the Knight of Wands. Come on, Aquarius. Let's do it how we used to do it back in the day, Judgment Card. Come on, we got history. This person is a <laughs> this person is something else. They a character. Clarify the Eight of Swords for this person's current feelings towards Aquarius. Knight of Pentacles. They could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Here's Virgo right here. It's a Virgo. Now this person will be in and out. This person is in their moods to where they want to make it work with you. This mood to where they want um to have fun that's all i get is i want to have some fun clarify the sun card three of pentacles i want to work come on Aqu aquarius aquarius come on i changed aquarius i changed for i changed this i can change for a couple of hours and then i'm back on my shit the devil card all right come on i got a, i only got a couple hours you're either gonna say yes or no with the ten of swords come on look, look. If you let me in, I'm gonna fuck up your life. But if we do this fast, you might we might can get through this with no casualties, okay? <laughs> this is not funny. This person is a piece of shit, five of swords. But for some reason, I'm laughing. This person is a jokester. They don't have good intentions, but they're like super lighthearted, like, like it's okay to treat people this way. Like <laughs> this person is like Come on, Aquarius. Aquarius. Hey, Aquarius. I'm in town. 
was good. All right, give me a, a different person, a, somebody who's not a dick, please. What's this person's current feelings towards Aquarius? All right. Seven of Swords. They feel like you're a liar or a cheater or they're a liar or a cheater. It's a Taurus Virgo Capricorn with the King of Pentacles. Ten of Swords. Now, a lot of heartache and pain. Ace of Wands. Okay. Clarify the Seven of Swords for this person's current feelings towards Aquarius. King of Wands. You might have fire in your chart, Aquarius. So this person might have fire in their chart. King of Wands, Page of Wands. This person's current feelings is they're trying to strategize on how to bump into you. How to send a message out. They're just trying to get you to respond. That's all I get. They're trying to get you to respond. Clarify the King of Pentacles. Seven of Cups. They're planning on how to get you to respond. I wonder if this gift will do it. Or if I spend money on them or tell them I'll take them out. Like what will what will make Aquarius respond? Clarify the Seven of Cups and the King of Pentacles. Strength holding back. They're just trying to they're trying to break your barriers down, break your walls down. They're trying to uh get you they're trying to get you back stuck on them. Clarify the ten of swords. Seven of wands, yeah. Clarify the ten of swords and the seven of wands. Nine of pentacles. This person is single. They like how independent and single you are, but this person, people is their game. They like to play that. They like to play people. Clarify the Ace of Wands. The Emperor could be an Aries. Someone who you really never know how they feel. They're very stubborn as well. Clarify the Ace of Wands and the Emperor. The Tower. They have great sex. They put it down in the bedroom. That's how you know who it is. They put it down in the bedroom. Like the best sex you ever had. Like you don't even know where you're at after. Clarify the Ace of Wands, the Emperor, and the Tower. Five of Swords. If you fuck with this person again, it will end up, end up in conflict and defeat. And you will, they'll ghost you again. All right? It's a Virgo. Okay. Pisces. <laughs> Pisces. Okay. <laughs> What's this person's current feeling towards my Pisces? What's this person's current feeling towards Pisces? Ten of Swords, it's over. They hurt you. Their feelings for you, they feel like you're hurt. You're sad. Not a Swords. They feel like the only reason why you're going off on them is because you're upset about something. Three of Swords. Yeah, you're still... Uh, this person feels like you're stuck on them and you will be stuck on them for a long time. This is a cocky-ass bitch. Clarify the Ten of Swords. This is the hanged man, the observer. Somebody who looks at things in a different perspective. Trying to figure out different solutions. See different ways about how to go about this. Ten of Swords. So this person um, in the world... This person thinks that if if you're not focused on them, like, this is the cocky ass bitch. They feel like you should be focused on them at all times, no matter if you're hurt, no matter if you're happy, no matter, like, anything. Clarify the Knight of Swords. I usually never get this energy for you, Pisces. Ace of Cups. With the knight of swords clarify the ace of cups and the knight of swords for this person's current feelings for pisces six of swords this person feels like you want attention you'll do anything for it even if it hurts them to do it even if you gotta hurt yourself to do it this person don't feel like you're being yourself right now and they're wondering why you acting like this what did I say in the beginning? 
The only reason why you're mad at me or talking to me this way is because you're upset. The only reason why you're cussing me out or talking to me this way is because you're upset about something else. This isn't who you really are. Clarify the Three of Swords for this person's current feelings for Pisces. Five of Wands. Combative. Three of Swords, Five of Wands. So you're probably sneaking around, talking to other people, trying to make somebody jealous. Being dramatic, combative, argumentative. Clarify the Three of Swords and the Five of Wands. Ace of Wands, Hierophant, and Four of Wands. This isn't who you really are. You're a wonderful, calm, peaceful person. You got your shit together. You're stable. You do certain things by the book. You do certain things um, this way, not that other way. This person, I don't know if it's a friend, a family member, or something like that, but they have genuine like concern for you, genuine feelings for you. But I feel like this person's current feelings is it's not peaceful in the home. With the five of pentacles, yeah, five of pentacles, ten of cups. It's not peaceful in the home. I just said that. Clarify the seven of wands. King of cups. They still love you. They still love you. Clarify the Seven of Wands and the King of Cups. They feel like you're just mad at them right now. You'll be back, Magician. You'll be back, Six of Pentacles, the Star. You'll be able to work it out with the Emperor. Okay? You'll be, that's how they feel. Go have your fun for now. Go act single for now. Go do what you want to do for now. But you'll be back. This person is, this person is like, this not even you, Pisces. I don't know what your deal is. Go have your fun. Come back to me when you get your mind back. Like, come back to me when you're done having your fun or some shit like that. They feel like you will come back. Ten of Pentacles. All right? This is all I have for you, Pisces. Thank y'all so much for coming back to my channel. You can like, share, subscribe. Leave me a comment. Leave me a love donation. Book a personal reading with me. Until I see you all again, check out your April monthly. I've already done them for you. Check out all of the All Signs readings. Your weeklies will be by Element. And y'all can donate to really help me that y'all donate will really help me. Or you can book a personal reading with me. There's a link in the description box to donate as well. Until I see you again, y'all be safe. Bye. Hey.